Hello, today let's solve this integral. This problem is selected from the Putnam exam, 1982, and I will use a simple method to solve this problem. And let's get started. So first, we define a function i here, and this function only depends on the parameter a. So we can see if we set a equals to 1, then we got i1 equals to 0. And for the original problem, it equals to the value when we set a equals to pi. And then we apply Feynman's trick to do the derivative. And note here, this derivative is respect to the variable a, so we treat x as a constant. Then the second term vanishes after we taking the derivative. And then we take the 1 over x term out of the derivative. After we taking the derivative, we got here. And the note for the x on the numerator is coming from the chain rule. So these two terms cancel out. And I copy it here. This integral is simple, so we just integrate it. After plugging numbers, we got here. And the next, we do the integration to solve for i. So we got here. And don't forget the constant c. And then we plug in this condition to determine the constant c. So from this equation, we got c equals to 0. Therefore, we got the result for this integral in a general form. And then we set a equals to pi. So we got this final answer. And don't forget to subscribe my channel and give a like.